join in line. On your left side, she is the eldest female South American sea lion here. And she is the prettiest. And her name is Isis. She's going to win trainer Mark. While on the other side is one of the youngest and the smartest among our sea lion friends. And her name is Yeni. Now guys, what do you think is the reason why sea lions are called fin or feather-footed marine mammals? Do they have feathers? Hey guys, do you have feathers? No. Well, it's definitely because of their front flippers, which are shaped like a bird's wing. You know? The term fin fins may also be translated as wing-footed, since the flippers will look somewhat like wings. In fact, Sea lions appear to be flying underwater as they swim from place to place, right girls? Yes, that's right. And they're also mistaken as seals because they look very much alike. But one obvious difference between a seal and a sea lion is the fact that sea lions have bigger front flippers. And they can also turn their back flippers, something seals cannot do. As a result, they can walk upright while on land. And there it is, and that's a fine demonstration. So how about a big round of applause for Yeni and Isis? And you know what guys? Sea lions have this long and flexible neck. How flexible it is? Check this out. <laughs> well that's not easy, and because of that they deserve another round of applause. As you can see, their bodies covered with a thin coat of short, coarse hair. Their whiskers help the sea lion's sense of touch. It contains nerve fibers which make them smile. I mean sensitive. They may also use their whiskers to aid in navigation or to detect vibration from prey in the water. And their small external ears give them a good sense of hearing both above and below the surface of the water. Sea lions, like many marine mammals, can see well both above and underwater. They have a keen eyesight, but no color vision. <laughs> In the wild, they inhabit waters close to shores, but rocky cliffs with dive pools, and has a preference for rocky beaches. They have an excellent climbing up. Flippers are stretched out behind their butt, functioning like brothers for steering. And that's their normal swim. Thank you very much, Yanny. Hey, but you know what? When chasing their prey or escaping predators, they can achieve a bird speed of up to 25 miles per hour. Now guys, would you like to see the best swim? How about that, Isis? Why no, girl? Oh my, Isis can't hear you guys. Louder, please. Would you like to see the fast swim? Yeah! Convincing! So whenever you're ready, Isis, on your mark, hit it, girl! Oh. And that is surely the fast swim. So how about a big round of applause for Isis and Yeni? I'm here. Good job, girls. Yes, a round of applause for you. An interesting story about sea lions is that the U.S. Navy has trained a few of them to take part in their special operations. They're able to rest hold for up to 20 long minutes and they can dive off hundreds of feet. Abilities that even the best Navy diver would be envious of. And since they cannot be detected by radar underwater, they are taught to recognize and avoid underwater mines. Everybody please salute and please 
Now let's start counting. One. 